today is such a day. I am a little late for work. The driveway was just a touch icy and I slipped and I fell. So I'm a little I'm a little frazzled and I have a cut on my pinky and I haven't had time to stop and take a look at it. Plus I don't have any like first aid things so I can't even do anything about it right now until I get to school. Like honestly guys, I felt like crying. And I said to Hina, I got off the phone, I'm like, you know what, I gotta go because I feel like I'm gonna cry. I didn't cry, but it was coming. I didn't vlog yesterday being Monday because yesterday was my last class for my special education additional qualification. And so I just wanted to get that out of the way. And to be quite honest with you, usually when I have class on Mondays, um, I used to have class on Mondays and Thursdays and I'm just so, so happy that like it ended just in time for Vlogmas because it really kind of takes up my day because I obviously am doing work to prepare for the class and my Monday classes were two hours long. And so I really wanted to just focus on it being my last class yesterday. And so now I just have a couple things to wrap up for that course to submit to my instructor and then I'll be good to go. Today being Tuesday, nothing extra special planned. It's honestly just gonna be us prepping for Vlogmas. The tree is dressed. The house is getting a nice, lovely clean. Lave has swimming today at 6.30. Cleaners are coming at nine. So I am at work. I actually need to text the cleaner and let her know what the plan is. I had to put like a, I had to put a, a pin on her door because her door is uh, automated. So I had to put a pin on her door for the cleaner to have access. And then that's like her personal pin um, for getting in. I need to do my screening to get into work. I can go to school or childcare. I'll see you soon. Bye guys. Hi everyone, welcome back. It is just after three and I just got home from work. It's Tuesday, Lathe has swimming today at 6.30. The cleaner just left and she did a really amazing job and so I think we're gonna end up having her come in a bit more regularly. I'm so happy with what she's done to the place. <laughs> I'm so very excited. I'm gonna crack open a bottle of white, get started on dinner. Today we're making codfish fritters. So Hina got a new coffee machine and it has like a flat top, so that's where you guys are sitting. <laughs> it is the last day of November. Tomorrow is December 1st, officially the first day of Vlogmas. My advent calendar is not here, so I don't think I'll be starting my Vlogmas with an advent calendar. Um, I hope it comes before the month is over, but we'll see, we'll see how that goes. I have just booked an appointment with my orthodontist because I am getting Invisalign. That's exciting. I've decided that I'm gonna get Invisalign. It's always been something that I've wanted to do. And now that we have double insurance, it is something that I can do, which is really nice. Sorry, I'm looking at my calendar. I've also made all of Lake's makeup, makeup classes for his swimming that he's missed. So he has a couple classes this week because the goal is to use up his makeup tokens so then that way we can cancel this class and move him somewhere else because I just don't feel like we're getting good value for our money where he is. And I've also been looking into ice skating lessons so he can learn how to do that and skiing lessons as well. And so there's just a lot guys having kids is hard don't have kids we are getting work done on our basement and i think they start next week so i just got off the phone with my uncle this morning and he's sending his guys in next week for those of you who don't know my uncle is a licensed general contractor and so he has his team and they're gonna come in and get to working on our basement. I'm really excited to show you my plans for the space and just kind of like what I've been thinking of doing with the space. We're gonna have them come in and do the first stage of work, then we're gonna break for the holidays and then pick it back up in the new 
year. It's a bad time to start, but he really wanted to get his guys in before the new year started. And so I'm really excited for that. I also did a poll on my YouTube channel. If you go and check out my posts, you'll see a poll that I did just asking you guys what kind of videos that you want to see for 2022. The interesting thing is so far I've had quite a few votes and most of you, 78% of you at the time I'm saying this, have voted for vlogs. So most of you have, voted, have voted for vlogs. Very few of you have voted for hauls. And then the second running is home decor content. The thing is, I know I have like a dedicated subscriber base for my vlogs, but my vlogs are also my least viewed videos on my YouTube channel. And so it translates to me that like, they're not good enough and so it's it's more of like a favor I'm asking you guys if you guys really like my vlogs tell a friend although I will say I do like filming vlogs I like showing you guys my day I don't think they're always very interesting all I'm asking for a Christmas present is to tell a friend and I uh, get them to subscribe to my channel and watch my vlogs I'd really appreciate it thank you guys so much also so excited. I just ordered our family holiday cards. This is the first year I'm doing that. I've never done that before. And because we took some really, really lovely photos for the holidays this year with Blue Aspen Photography, I'll leave her link down below um, to her Instagram page, but she's such a talented black photographer local here um, to the GTA. And we had a Christmas mini session with her and we had some photos taken of our family. And I just got them back yesterday and oh my God, I'm so blown away. Some are going to Florida, some are going all the way to Jamaica. So as soon as I get them, they need to like go out ASAP. I'd love to share a holiday card with one of my viewers. And so um, if anybody's interested in a holiday card, just let me know down below. I won't have many. I only ordered 20 for this year, but I'll... I would love to send one or two of you a holiday card if you want. So if you're interested, just let me know in the comment section down below and then maybe I'll do like a giveaway. What I'm drinking today is the Pinot Gris from Wayne Gretzky Estates. It's a 2020. This is really good white wine, guys, and it's a good, cheap white wine. I really, really like it. I go by taste. I like dry wines, um, so I like my wines that are not super sweet. I like them to be really dry, and so I really like the their white, their Pinot Gris. I haven't tried their Chardonnay, but I do have it. And their Rosé is also really good. I love a good Rosé. And so I highly recommend it. These are, guys, these are so affordable. They're like $13, $14 a bottle. And we got the case of 12 um, from the wine shop. We had the red, I think, a week ago. And it was really good, really enjoyed it. I do love the white. It should have been chilled. I'm not gonna be that person to put ice in my wine, so I am gonna drink my first glass warm, but I'm gonna put the bottle in the fridge so that it can chill a little bit. But it actually is really good and I highly recommend it if you guys are looking for a new wine to try or if you've had your eye on this one and you wanted to try it, try it. I'm going to finish my wine. I'm gonna just relax in my lovely clean house and um, I will catch you guys later on today once Hina and Leith gets home. Oh! I jumped! You I jumped. did! I jumped! Let's do that again! Okay. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay, come here. Wait, 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 wait! <laughs> I knocked you
just here making some salt fish fritters or fish cakes. Um, and so I have boiled and flaked some codfish that I had and then I just emptied the pack here. I'm gonna add some water, then I'm gonna mix these two together and then we're gonna fry it all up and I'll show you guys how it came out. Here are the fritters or the fish cakes. I think they came out okay. The batter is a little flat and personally I prefer like my own batter with the codfish. I felt like the batter was a little bit over seasoned. They taste good and they're a little, they're a little crunchy which is nice but I'm used to my, my, my salt fish fritters or my fish cakes being a little bit thicker, a little bit more crunchy. Uh, not so seasoned because when you do it with just the flour and the codfish and a little bit of like baking powder and baking soda, it comes out really good. Much better. Much better. But I, I, I don't like this batter. What do you think? I don't like the batter either. What? Yeah. It's just past six. And Lathe has gone off swimming with Hina. They've gone to their swimming lessons for the day, for the evening, his makeup class. And the house is quiet. And I don't think I've ever had the house this quiet on a school night. And so I'm gonna take advantage of that and I'm gonna have a hot bath. I'm gonna run the tub. <laughs> So I'm going to put some piano music on. I have a piano Christmas playlist that I absolutely love and I'll share it with you guys. I'll share the link um, below. There's also this amazing pianist called Alexis French who I spoke about in Vlogmas Day 1. He's also really talented so I'll post the links to them down below because that's what I'm going to listen to right now. I'm going to play it on the Sonos. The lights are still kind of builder grade and so they come off a little bit more warm on camera, whereas our pot lights in the on the first floor that are new that we had installed after the fact um, are a lot more on the neutral side, which we do love. Um, but the ones in the bedrooms still need to be switched out. But I'm just in bed. I just put on my cozy PJs. These are the linen ones from banana republic and honestly guys it's so pretty i hope it's coming off on camera but the colors are like blue and purple and some like peach tones and it's really gorgeous it's giving me very big dior vibes which i absolutely love i also love that it's linen very breathable but it also keeps me um really nice and cool at night when I'm sleeping because I run warm on my, when I'm sleeping and I wake up sweating. So I love these PJs. I actually just purchased a second set and it's this like really gorgeous like a wine pink um, and it's really stunning and it's in the mail and I can't wait to show it to you guys once it gets here. I'm really into matching PJs lately and Hina sees my matching PJs and she's like more of my matching PJs. So now I might have to get her uh, matching PJs for Christmas. We'll see. But love it. Just thought I'd share it with you guys. That is it for tonight's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to jump into bed now. Actually, I'm going to go edit this vlog so that you can have it. But thank you so much for watching, guys. And I'll catch you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 4. Have a good night.